Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So back in May of last year, I posted a video telling you you can now create pass keys for your Google accounts to replace passwords. And I showed you how to set up a pass key for your Google account. Now, once again, video will be linked down below and in the end screen. But the reason I'm mentioning that video is because, as you may well know, up until now, you could only save pass keys to Google Password Manager on Android. And you could use them on other devices, but you needed to scan a QR code using the Android device. Now, this is all changing because uh, Google has announced now that you can now save pass keys to Google Password Manager from Windows, Mac OS, Linux, and Android with Chrome OS currently available for testing only in beta. So if you are running Chrome OS, uh, it's still in preview. And then once they are uh, saved, they'll automatically sync across your devices, making signing in easy and black, as, as you can see in the example, you just scan your fingerprint. Now, in case you were unaware what pass keys are, they let you use your fingerprint, face, or screen lock to uh, sign into apps and websites. And then something else uh, Google has mentioned, they say that to let you create pass keys and access saved ones across your devices, um, Google say they're introducing a new Google Password Manager PIN. And apparently this PIN adds an additional layer of security, they say, to ensure your pass keys are end-to-end -end encrypted and can't be accessed by anyone, not even Google. Now, when you start using pass keys on a new device, you'll need to know either your Google Password Manager PIN or the screen lock for your Android device. And these recovery factors will allow you to securely access your saved pass keys and sync new ones across your computers and Android devices, according to Google. So, and pass keys now seem to be rolling out a lot more across the board when it comes to the Google apps and services. And although it's a lot easier signing into your account, I have seen a couple of comments when I did post that video in May of last year that obviously when it comes to using your fingerprint face or screen lock, a lot of users have privacy concerns um, with obviously pass keys and um, using your face and the biometrics, so to speak, or your, um, your fingerprint. So if you are concerned about privacy, um, then maybe this is something you want to stay away from. But nonetheless, just putting it out there if you are tied into the Google ecosystem. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.